Hey guys, Chainfire here, and welcome back to another episode of PYOB Monday. Hey, Prince of Darkness. Hey, Joey. Hey, Sandy. Hey, Matthews. Hey, David Swinton. Hey, Jesus Beaver. Hey, John Ellis. <clears throat> What's up, brother? Hey, bro. I only have two aphids. I can do a Jesse, but um, what do you want to see with it? Plasma Gareth, you got it. So guys, once again, uh, for those of you who are new to PYOB Monday, PYOB Monday is a live stream for you guys to have an opportunity to uh, request different builds that you don't know if you'd like or uh, wouldn't like to run. Um, things that uh, you're thinking, different builds that you're thinking of, uh, of building and you want to see how that works out for you. So uh, that is definitely something that you can request here. Um, we do have a pretty decent list that you can see in the description uh, of different things that you can request. Okay, let's see what other requests we have here. Mason, that may or may not be possible. Let's see. Thunder, Orc, Lance. You got it. So we're going to put that on the... Um, well, let's put it right now on the uh, level 12 for now. I got him up to level 10. The uh, other Lance. But let's see what else we got going on here. Christian, as for a Carnage Zeus, you got it, brother. Carnage Zeus, done. Pinata, Jesse. Pro, you want um, Pinatas and Aphids? I can do that. If that's something you want to see and you're thinking of building, absolutely. Hey, HK. <laughs> A Jesse with four Nera comes. Bright. Quad Pinata Jesse. Okay. Um, yeah, I think we can do that. I've never run that before, so let's see how that uh, works out for us. Quad Pinata Jesse. I may have to pull some Pinatas off of. Uh, I don't even know how many I have. But let's uh, just to be on the safe side. Let's go ahead and pull some off of uh, off of this guy. If I'm already doing that, let me just go ahead and pull off these Orkins too. And then just change robot. There he is. Okay, and this means that we'll be able to do um, we'll be able to do the uh, the Fujin, I believe. Let me just go ahead and make sure. Let me go back here a second and chat. The chat is running. It's a little bit racy. Okay, so Mason, I think I'll be able to do that request for you. Okay, let's see. I should have enough Pinatas. I don't even know what's going on right now on my hangar. Where are my Pinatas? 
Okay, so those are not what I'm looking for. Yeah, so we'll be able to do the Fujin Terran. We're gonna uh, we're gonna do that next. Let me see where those peanut where those pinatas are. Oh, I got them all over the place. Okay, let's unequip this bad boy. And then we wanted a Fujin Terran. We have enough for that. We're almost ready to roll out here, guys. So that's good. Awesome. So we got all the requests in for today. Um, yeah, Sandy, I have a, I have a fury. We are uh, full for tonight, though. So let's go ahead and take a quick look at our hangar for tonight. Hey, Noob King. Hey, Oscar. <clears throat> hey, Juan. Who has no house now? He will never build. Whoever is alone now, long will so remain. Will stay awake and read and write long letters. So let me go. Um, how far into the event tasks? It's a good question. One. So I'm at uh, I'm at the Terran now. Yeah, I uh, unfortunately haven't gotten to play as much as I uh, as much as I was hoping. I wanted to, I, I was hoping I'd be able to play more over the last uh, over the last couple of days. Though I've been uh, super busy. I had uh, some job interviews today and stuff, so been dealing with that. Hey, William Gomez. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and roll out. Hi, Mason. All right, we're on power plant. And it looks like we dropped in here in a not very good timing, but let's go ahead and actually start with Jesse in this case. Have some a little bit of speed and help us catch up with these guys who've already uh, been running here along. Turn the music down for you guys a little bit. All right, tell me if uh, the levels are no good. I think this guy might be our first victim here. Now the rhino's uh, pushing him back. Let's see if I can go after this. Uh, Fire me from behind. Lay that into him. He's more concerned about that guy than he is me. Let's see if I can't run through here. Oh my gosh, we're getting a five cap on us right now. Son. Fuck! Not a very good situation. I put myself there, though. I was kind of asking for that. All right, let's get something with a little bit of a uh, range here. Just kind of uh, get a little bit of a read on the battlefield. This is very odd. This is very, very odd. These matches are really weird. This this matchup. 
the people I'm with here. This is very unexpected. They're uh, they're running some very interesting setups. This is what's uh, making me wonder what's going on here. These are not things I normally see in uh, my tier. A little choppy, sorry. Okay. My Zeus is not going to be ideal here. They're very low on beacons. Looks like we only got four players. Um, see if I can't actually get some use out of this uh, Carnage Zeus. I'm afraid this is not going to be very ideal for me here. That Stalker is going to go into stealth as soon as uh, I come around the corner here. Yep. We are probably going to lose this game. When I say probably, I mean for sure. <laughs> He's probably going to be able to get into stealth again. That, um... This guy is trying to run into my shield here. He is successful at it. Especially with the, the uh, choppiness of this... Um, connection that I have right now. This is no bueno, and I don't have my rush. Okay, as soon as I get my rush, I will be able to get more of an angle at him. Okay, that's fucked up. Super fucked up. I'm actually gonna... I'm really curious to take a look at the, uh, the different hangers that uh, these guys are running. Regardless of the fact that that was like a, a four or three versus six. What the hell? Something majorly wrong with matchmaking there. You know what I'm afraid happened? I think I'm actually in the tankers league right now, because what happened? My iPad died uh, just before I, I I took a break. My iPad died. This is so fucked up. My iPad died when I was running with my guys. They were super pissed about it, and I think it may have kicked me into the tankers league after one game. All right, hold on one second. Let's see what you guys are saying about this. Does this, uh, <clears throat> I don't know, have you guys ever, any one of you seen the uh, Tanker League or what it looks like? I've actually never been in it. Um, hey, what's up, mother? Driving in a mug or something. Uh, my iPad, sorry, it didn't actually die, uh, the app crashed. That's actually what happened. Um, the game app crashed, and it looks like now I'm, I'm, like, in the Tankers League or something, because I've never, I've never placed with players like that. Let's see what happens here in the next game. Let's see, I don't know. Tankers League is deactivated during event. Your iPad, you... I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's see what's going on here. Okay, in this case, we're actually going to start with Lance. It looks like uh, we are up against uh, definitely a top tier uh, squad here. This is a group of squad of Fox. These guys are really good players, so let's see what happens now. Got a Carnage Thunder with me there. That's good, and he'll be able to take any Ansels down. Which it doesn't actually seem that we have any Ansels up against us right now. Let's get up on that corner there. I 
I hope that guy with the, sh the Ansel is right behind me. Fuck, come on, man. <laughs> Needed that shield right now. Um, yeah, this is another thing, guys. Make sure that uh, you're looking around you. Another thing when it comes to team play is look around you and see who... If you have an Ansel, if you have, you know, a physical shield... You know, use your physical shield to protect your teammates. You got an Ansel shield, make sure to use that to protect your teammates. Because that right there, I mean, is just such a sad situation. He's gonna kind of corner shoot at me, but I'm actually gonna gun for him. Get our shield up there. Someone behind me firing splash. It's not from my team. Damn it. Why does it say destroyed? Really weird. Alright, let's get something fast here. We need some beacons. What's up, Juan? Guy over here with pilot with a pilot name. Let's see if I can slip through here right now. Behind the uh, battlefield here. See, we got some uh, Ansel shields there. Be able to get through those. Just try to pull him and his attention our way. Damn it! Yeah, no sucker. All right, we are definitely going to need uh, some heavy firepower right now. We keep losing our home. It's no bueno. It doesn't actually matter how many times we uh, get the left side. When you're low on beacons, a lot of times you know, like it's you're like, okay, I'm getting hammered here. You know, I may as well pull out my uh, my Carnage uh, Zeus here. But the thing is, you always you only pull out range when you have the beacon advantage. Don't like brawling with him like this, but I don't think we have much of a choice here. We're gonna be going for A here shortly as well. Help. Shit. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Totally fucked that one up. Leg movement on that thing is so fucked up. <laughs> Back! I don't know if I'm able to hit this guy. Yeah, okay, he's turning his side to me. That's good, I'm gonna be able to get another shot at him as well. I'm gonna get his attention my way, to be honest. I don't want him to go for A. That guy biffed it a little bit. Okay, let's go back for B. Okay, 
those guys should be able to take care of him. I'm going to go ahead and rush. Um, so right now, it looks like they're heavy at our home. I'm going to get one hit at that guy and then try to see if I can rush for their home. No, doesn't seem like it's going to happen. Mm, very tough, 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 tough. most I can do here is actually stay with my teammates and defend. We definitely lost this one, there's no question about that. So I'm just gonna go for damage now. Watch our back. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that. You'll get the image back here in a sec. Dang it. Hey Gustavo! Hey Clayton! Let's see what they do here. About to get fucked. <laughs> okay! Alright, that was interesting. Okay, now it's, it's, uh, now it's Masters. All masters and one champion. That's still very interesting. I. These guys are definitely all champion. That's strange. Matchmaking was being pretty, uh, pretty good yesterday, and then today, first game was terrible. Everyone was under masters, and now at least I got masters here. So that's uh, interesting. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Gustavo. Hey, big hairy dangly balls. Hey, William. Hey Justin, yeah, I do remember you, man. Welcome back. Hey Bianca. All right, let's roll, guys. Hey, Mar... Mar... Dia. Mardia. Did I pronounce that right? Mardia? <laughs> now you know how I feel with the matchmaker. <laughs> hey, Theo. Hey, Edwin. You won two lances? Sweet. That's, that's 10,000 gold worth. That's amazing. Hey, X. Hey, Sarkar. Hey, Devil Machine. I'm good. How are you doing? No, Mesa, the Fuji is it can do well. Let's 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 see how we can do with it um, on other maps and other situations. Let's see what we can do with it. All right, we're gonna gun straight for center. I think that stalker is actually gonna go and take uh, that right there. He's gonna take those two beacons. So we're gonna gun straight for center. 
Hey, 16. Hey, Christopher. Hey, Mr. Blade, kill them all. That's right, baby. Red is dead. Sucker already made it here. Hey, buddy. Whoa, yeah, the lag is bad. The lag is bad, bad, bad right now. And there's a rhino. Holy shit, they got a fuck ton of fucking. Whoa! Holy hell. Alright, I actually think the, the, the Fujin is gonna be good right here. It doesn't have the same speed that it had on the test server we were testing it, but uh, this should still be fine. Holy shit, that thing, that, that, uh, I don't know if you guys seen that, but if you saw it, the, uh, test server that we ran, ridiculous speeds on the Raijin and Fujin. So, uh, we're gonna get this guy in good position. Uh, the Fujin does have a pretty significant, uh, energy shield, so that should help us with the insane amount of splash that they brought down there right now, uh, dude. All you gotta do is fire in whatever direction you want to go, and that'll give me an indication. So because you're, um... Because your Orkins reload so fast, use them to indicate to your teammates uh, what direction you're thinking of going. We're gonna reload here real quick. I think he's gonna try to get in corner, corner shooting position on me. Let's see who we got here on our team. Nobody helpful. There goes his physical shield. And I'm dealing with some lag still. That's terrible. That's just horrible. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate your help, man. My man. Stay behind cover here. We'll let them unload. Empty their orc in their uh, whips. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I brought this thing out to deal with the insane amount of splash, but suddenly it's like freaking Termageddon around here. I like what I did with that. Terrence, Armageddon, Termageddon. Ah! 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 <laughs> Alright, let's get some splash in the center now. Holy shit. Oh, shit. Freaking... Okay, good. <sighs> yes, yes. You want to basically lay those into your targets. We're gonna flip as soon as. Uh... Nice, nice trap shot there, buddy. I want to be careful. From... Loki is a Loki is a good, good player. God freaking damn it! Son of a bitch. I'm gonna try to get those in the corner of the screen, in the corner of the center, where um, away from the Ansel. Fuck my life. They keep bringing out like everything that is not what I'm expecting it to be, and we're low on beacon, so I'm gonna have to push here. 
with another push bot. I'm not going to be able to freaking A. We're so low on beacons. Um, whoever requested that uh, Carnage Zeus, I'm, I'm sorry, buddy. This We're not getting opportunities to use them. Hey, Mark. Chip away at that guy. Oh. Okay, let's start working this guy. Okay, nice, nice, nice. This is actually looking good here, boys. Looking much better. Much, much better. Shred that Ansel. Use our boost and rush into center. Said so Loki is a good player, so we're gonna have to be careful. We also have those uh, tridents firing at us, and he dropped. Very smart of him. Perfect timing to drop there. He knows that those uh, tridents are gonna take another shot here shortly. So I'm gonna try to drop here. I don't want those. I don't want to get hit by those tridents, of course. And also use my boost to get back. Shit, it didn't work the first time I pushed the button. But we're gonna boost backwards in hopes to uh, get away from most of this guy's work and fire. He's still firing those. Um, he's still firing his. Uh, he knows my physical shield is down. He did a good job there taking out my. Um, taking out my physical shield and hitting those, uh, just using those thunders to try to chip at my health. So Loki's going to be moving into center right now here again. I'm trying to shred those ansels to at least help that, uh, that DB get a couple of good hits. And now we're going to boost into center. This guy is dropping after him. I guess he's assuming that Loki's getting center. Which is good. They also do have to an extent the uh, beacon advantage, so uh, I guess that was okay on his part, but unfortunately because of that it looks like they may not get center, they got center. Never mind. All right, keep hitting that Ansel because right now I don't have an angle to fire at him. Okay, prevent that guy from moving into center, try to help our teammate here. And Loki's backing up. Very smart. Very smart gameplay on these guys' behalf. And that's going to finish me off because I don't think I have a uh, physical shield left. Oh well. Alright. Alright, last mech here. Um, we only have four players. It's 4v4. But as we can tell from what's going on so far, trying to sneak in from that side and get in their home beacon at this point it's pretty much a suicide mission. Loki's physical shield is down, I can actually see it. So this is gonna hit him. Okay, now let's get out of the way of those geckos. We needed, uh, if we had uh, about two more minutes on the clock, no, even one more minute actually, because Th those those guys should have brought out those those bots sooner. Those bots could have helped sooner. God damn. <sighs> hey there, Emerald Nuke. How's it going, brother?
Well, Edwin, you did. You got something good. You got two lances. That's pretty good. That's good in my book. Going so hell nowadays. Yeah, yeah, it kind of is. Uh, alright, alright, let's see what happens in this next game. Alright, Dead City. Start with our Gareth. Because the Gareth has a physical shield, we're gonna start with this bad boy. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to start with the Gareth, we're going to assess the uh, map situation and then see when it's time to bring out that Jesse. I want to do some more of that Jesse gameplay. Um, in the last game you basically saw, uh, you know, it's it's the same with Orkins and Pinatas. As far as, uh, okay hold on a second, that's an RDB, wow these guys are pushing center hard right now. That's fine though. Start with this uh, Griffin. We're gonna switch targets onto this uh, Galahad right now. We're gonna corner shoot at him. That guy's showing us his back. Oh, dang it. Targeting, you can do better than that. Let's turn back to that Griffin. He's gone. Alright, buddy. See, this is not a good position. We are going to attempt getting around to the other direction. So you always want to be in, in the position where you can corner shoot at him and not vice versa. going on here. Holy fucking moly. Holy fuck. Um, uh, this is tricky. Alright, the lance. The lance is, is, is our best choice right here. We need that shield. We need, we need the physical shield. I wish uh, this was an Ancelot. Oh, that guy's fucking sneaky. Mother... <laughs> I'm getting so worked up over here. Those are freaking DBs. Ah, we need Ansel. Where the? F They're all here on this side. This is fucking bullshit. I'm going over this, isn't it? All right, here comes our Ansel. Okay, okay, good, good, my man. I'm just like losing hit points. I don't even know where they're going. All right, the Ansel moved and take the uh, take the beacon. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna let him get that. Oh no, this is someone else. But okay, we got two Griffins there. Start chipping at this guy. Hopefully push him back because of the sign. I can't see what he is. Oh fuck! He took out my Ansel shield. My protection. out of range now. Let's see what this guy is. Holy shit, this freaking sign is so annoying. Every time I see this, I look, wait. Gotta look above it. Ah, didn't move out. Oh my god, we're getting fucking overrun. This is freaking crazy. All 
All right, we're gonna stay out of that that side. So you're already low. We're down a player at least, at least one player. Break this is so fast. I don't even think we can, like, we're 4 cap right now, I can try to get their home beacon, but, I mean, my uh, chances of freaking survival are uh, not very good right now. Damn! Took me down, that was, that is a maxed, that is a max Jesse. He just deleted me. Holy hell, these guys came out with insane firepower. Getting hit by uh, Plasma over here on the side. Damn, damn, fuck! Fucking shit! Son of a bitch, go fuck yourself, fucking die. Holy fuck! Hey, what's up, Lee? Hey, Gio. Hey, Togi. Alright guys, let's just go into the next game here. Frustrating, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we're up against here. This is perfect for the uh, Carnage Zeus right here, guys. This is perfect, perfect, perfect. So now we get to see uh, uh, some... This is awesome, be tough. Okay, so this guy, we're going to hit him, he's going to be forced to close his shield. It'll slow him down a little bit. These guys are going to be tough, I can tell you that already now, but I'm actually going to go work on those tridents. That's what my team needs me for right now the most. Try to get a nice angle here, because that spot right over there is a really good spot for them to try to corner shoot at you. Oh, dang it. Oh, fuck. Luckily his Terrans were out by the time he got close enough.
trying to get to where uh, a good position, a good firing position at those um, Fury Tridents. So the Fury Tridents actually went the other way. Just gonna try to work on his shield here. to let him get the beacon because I need to be working angles here. He wants that beacon. Now his shield will be easy really easy to take out. No my teammates going that way though. So all I gotta do is also provide a little bit of distraction and we're good here. Trying to get my Ansel shield close to this guy. If he's smart, he'll just back up. Trying to get this guy into my shield. There we go. Perfect. Good job, buddy. Okay, this is looking a little better this game. Crazy Days is coming right back at uh, this beacon here, our home beacon. Like uh, somebody worked his shield a little bit, so that's good. Worked his shield already. I feel like I'm so slow right now. It's a good thing that his Terran's deplenished right there. Got a nice angle there. So the thing is, as long as you're locked onto a target, even if you look away from him, um, you're, you see your weapons actually turn, and now they're they're facing towards him. See? No angle. All right, that Griffin's gonna be my next. <clears throat> He's trying to work uh, angles on my teammate there, the uh, Carnage Trident. Now, um, I think I'm actually going to drop this bot now. Let's see if I can do, if there's any much more that I can do with it. But I think uh, would be best because uh, they're coming back for our home again. So we are going to get center here. Let me try to slow this guy down. But yeah, I'm gonna have to drop this bot, I think. Um, or actually use it to go get their home beacon. My legs are broken. See, the thing is, this is tough. This is tough. If I drop this, this bot right now, I'm gonna be facing so much more than I can handle. That guy jumped for me, okay. Oh my goodness, this is me, uh, this is, this is pretty tough. Let's actually, the Gareth, because of its speed, we may be able to turn this around now. Using the Gareth and, uh, and his speed along with uh, his ability to cap beacons. And the, the fact that uh, a lot of these guys are in soft bots right now. So his teammate actually just, uh, Screwed him over a little bit there. Because uh, he wasn't able to back up. Okay, good. Hopefully my teammates are going to get uh, center beacon right now. I'm going to go get their home. We, uh, we can hopefully turn this around. Okay, let's lock on to that guy. As soon as I start firing at him, he's going to jump for me. Guaranteed. Either jump for me or away from me. Okay, so now that guy's going to jump for me. That's fine. As long as I get that beacon, we're fine. We should be okay here. Okay, the Rhino next. Open your shield. He's gonna open his shield now. We're gonna lose that beak. All right, let me at least try to get an angle at him. I'm gonna go all the way to the right, and then I'm gonna go left. Okay, see that? He missed pretty much all of his shots. And I end up in a situation where he can't be gunning for center. trying to pull him my way. Let's 
open shield run backwards. This is DB. We're gonna get about 300. Oh, god damn! Fuck. I feel like I'm doing everything here on my own. Something fast. We need those beacons. As soon as that guy lands, he's gonna Oh, oh. Son of a mother. Sorry, this is PYOP, and I'm just losing my I'm, I'm losing my shit here. This is freaking tough. This is freaking tough here, guys. This is insanely tough. Matchmaking! Fucking go home, you're drunk! So this guy is pulling them all up into Champions League. That's what it looks like. It looks like this guy's. Is... It's getting hot in here. <laughs> Hey, Alec. How's it going, brother? Yeah, beginning of the month is uh, is a little messy. It's going to be a little messy. Crazy Day is inviting me now. That's sweet of you, man. I'm running PYOB right now, though. I don't want to mess you guys up. And uh, it's fine, this way you guys get to see some rage. I know you don't mind. I'm assuming you don't mind. I'm sweating. Yeah, this is like... This is crazy. This is crazy. Let me also change a little bit the uh, contrast on the camera. Hold on one sec. Sharpness over here a little bit and change the contrast a little bit. This I believe should help. Let's see how it looks now. I think this should help. Alright, sorry about that guys, but yeah. This matchmaking is drunk because of vodka. Let the rage out. It's good for you. It's it's definitely good. Sweating is also good for you. It uh, it uh, it gets rid of all the toxins. Okay, no, actually, that made the picture look not as good. Hold on one sec. That should help. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. All right. Awesome. Moon map. I love the moon map. I love this map. Let's uh, let's do this, boys. Let's kick some ass. All right. So this looks like a uh, this actually looks like a good situation for the Fujin. Let's uh, let's take it over to the uh, left side if possible, or just right underneath the center. A little bit of lag here. Sorry about that. By the way, guys, um, now that I'm doing, <clears throat> pardon, now that I'm adding the uh, live chat here in the uh, in the live stream, um, I do want to take another this opportunity to uh, throw out a special thanks to David Swidden and Mythic for moderating the chat, and uh, also um, I want to let you guys know. So uh, after the stream last night, I uh, went back and uh, shit, I missed that shot. After the stream last night, I went back and some of you guys commented things that I couldn't respond to during the stream, that I didn't respond to, so um, there were some response that I just added um, and put it as a comment instead. So I'm using this guy's shield to my advantage. Alright. That guy's plasma and he can mess me up. So 
Sorry, buddy. You're gonna want to close your shield and stay in mine. I'm gonna work on this plasma guy. I'm gonna finish him off before he finishes me off. And I have to keep my I have to keep my shield up because of that um, that other guy there. All right. Right now we're going to uh, finish. Those guys are probably gonna be finished off here very very shortly. So let's bring out. Holy freak! What is going on here? How are we four capped? Why does that guy have an infinite shield? There he goes again. Let's work on the shield here. These guys are totally, like, steamrolling us. I'm gonna work on that Ansel shield. So they are throwing a lot of bots here into center, but we're gonna have a hard time turning this around because we're gonna need to grab a lot of beacons now. Okay, all right, all right, yeah, I understand. You're bigger and tougher. You can push me, that's fine. <laughs> wow, this just turned into like, just a rage fest. Okay, that guy's got that. That guy's going that way. Let me grab center and intercept. Okay, we need those guys to push that side. If they're able to do that, I'm not gonna push in here yet. Um, we gotta play it a little smart here, a little slow. Basically just uh, holding center here and uh, make sure that these guys don't push out. Oh my goodness, oh my god, almost, almost, oh god! Alright, let's get something fast here, let's get something fast and grab some beacons. Alright, that guy's dead. They're gonna grab that beacon. Hopefully this guy's gonna grab that beacon. Let's see if we can turn this around here, boys. I have a bad feeling about this. Like I said, these guys threw a lot of bots there at the beginning, which is gonna hurt them here. Because they threw so many bots out into center. Shit. No bueno. I'm gonna try to jump. Biff is jump. Desperately need beacons right now. Desperately, desperately need beacons. I can't go into center. At least not from the bottom. Don't want this guy getting our home beacon. Try to corner shoot at him. I'm gonna grab the beacon. Holy fuck, we're getting steamrolled here. This is fucking bull. Trying to use the uh, leveling to my advantage, basically uh, using even small objects to uh, try to corner shoot here. The only way we can win this is get a five cap like time meow, which is not going to happen. So uh, yeah, unfortunately this game is over. I'm gonna let him get the beacon. See if I can run. Nope, not going to happen. Not going to happen. We <laughs> oh my god. Ridiculous. It's just ridiculous. Like, this would be tough for me even with my normal hanger. Never mind, like, PYOB. And this hanger is a decent hanger. I mean, you can you can do some work with this hanger. This is, a, this is a definitely a decent hanger. Um, props to this guy for getting six beacons, man. Good job there. But again, I mean, it's just... Uh, what the hell is going on with matchmaking right now? What am I doing here? I don't remember last the beginning of last month being like this.
chain one man team. <laughs> Painfully to watch. Yes, yes, Mr. Blade is painful to play. It hurts. Oh my god. Yeah, Clayton, I know, I know. It's it's about teamwork, man. Um, it is about teamwork. The thing is, like, I don't want to be bringing anyone down right now. I feel like it'd be unfair of me to invite my friends. Um, but still, this is another reason, guys. I mean, it's just uh, you gotta you gotta have you gotta have teammates with you, you know. Um, work on your networking. Get more friends. Get them to join you. Alright, this is gonna be our last game here guys. But uh, as you can tell, I mean this is these are these are decent builds. These are all things you can work with. Um, okay, let's see what we got going on here now. This could be another ideal situation for that um, splash Ancelot. Lancelot. The uh, DB Lance. That's a good. Uh, that's a good build here. Ooh, Maestro's here. He's good. Good player. That guy's also good. Got gotcha, you, brother. Okay, this is actually. Um, this guy is actually bad news for me. I'm just gonna slide right through. Let my teammates take him out. They got more suitable builds for that. I'm in the wrong direction for these guys. This is where the Galaheads went. And those are the guys that I was trying to take out here. Oh, you're so fucked. Bye, Felicia. Finally. <laughs> it's a good thing we're winning this one, because I need a freaking win. I need a win. <laughs> too much. Tough. I've been getting beaten up all night. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, I'm still <laughs> Alright, let's say we're actually steamrolling these guys. They're all moving into beach. They want to get that dual uh, two in one beacons. Got here. That is a DB Griff. I'm waiting for him to jump. So as soon as I uh, as soon as I started firing, I held the uh, the button to activate the rush. And that's what saved me. If this is just 1v1 on that one guy, that is um, that is the way to uh, win that 1v1. Is if you're running backwards, if you use your rush to run backwards um, at three at, at even 200 meters, you're good. Versus uh, a Griffin DB, you gotta hit that button in the perfect moment, though. All right, so let's start working a shield here. And my teammates are going to take it from there. Looks like uh, that Griffin just jumped away from him and practically let him have the home. He's like, well, I'll let him have the home. I don't want to have to work that Ansel. That is not uh, team play. So even if it, you know, because I mean, you organs, they do reload. So all you got to do is like, at least even, at least unload them enough before you jump away, unload enough that um, you know. By the time you land, you're you'll be reloaded. Um, even just a little bit, just work on that shield even a little bit. Even if you are going to be that guy who, who doesn't actually uh, pursue a uh, Ancelot, at least, at least, at least, help your teammates out the least you can. 
by lowering that shield a little bit. Because if you're not going to deal with it, someone else is going to have to. See, so right now, like, this is not... I'm wor I've been working this shield, and that's right now. This guy, Maestro, is able to take the... Probably be able to break his uh, shield completely and get rid of him. Okay, so there goes his shield. He's Dunsky. We lost. And now they're moving back to their home. It's no bueno. Trying to get a wider angle at him now. Okay, this is not the best. We need to, um... I'm just gonna do some distracting here. Let that guy empty on me. Continue working his shield. At least help my teammates out a little bit here. Okay. And now... Let's attempt uh, getting those beacons on the side. We're gonna try to get A, B... Do you have some teammates over on that side? Mm, maybe best would be to actually uh, try to defend the pitcher's mount. What's going on here? Yeah, it looks like they got A and B. Okay, you know what? Actually, I'm going to let him be a distraction at this point. Nope. I'm not going to be able to. I, think, I, think I was thinking maybe we can slide over to their home. Just empty this clip first. And then slide over to their home. Back to get our home now. This is fucked. Oh, fuck my life. Alright, you know what? Go get your home. That's for a motherfucker. Both lost their shields now. I got very heavy firepower. That's why I'm trying to basically just assist them as much as I can. These guys are corner shooting now. Son of a bitch. Coming. <laughs> Vicious, how's it going, brother? <laughs> Savage, you got it. I'm going to switch out. I'm going to do one more game here, guys. Um, I'm going to switch out. The Fuji and Fort Workins.
And just so we don't finish with a loss, we're going to attempt winning this one. But what we're going to do is we are going to switch out. We're actually going to run a Carnage Thunder. Let's do it. interesting it's not a lot of plasma but let's do it what the hell let's do it yeah yeah let's run more one more game guys someone call 9.1 <laughs> oh my gosh dude that was so freaking frustrating okay we're straight into game here whoa this is like we got halfway through uh, we're still missing we're still down a player already What's up, Gary? So that guy's an RDB. Let's run away from the RDB. Reload our clip. Full trip. Now the nice thing is, a full trip, even if he does hit my shield, because my robot is maxed, I'm not concerned. He's actually running away. He's not even gonna hit the shield. Like, fuck this. I'm gonna go back for the beacon in a second here, guys. Just trying to see if I can at least not let them get the center beacon. Failed. That guy's almost dead. Sending reinforcements my way. <coughs> Finish off this RDB. Yeah, Stalker, what are you excited about? You're next. <laughs> Alright, this guy's jumping. If he's DB, I'm gonna have to back off. He is DB. Just look right through the building there. Is he ever gonna unload your freaking trips? Congratulations. Alright, let's get the center beacon here, at least white it. Shit, I'm running around the way. Damn! Almost. Okay, no worries. No worries. We got this, boys. So, we still got those trebs back there. That's my one concern with this guy right here. Um, okay. Let's see about... No. That guy's shield is not worked on at all. So what we have to do is uh, kind of get an angle here. I do see the crosser here. There's someone back there. It's that DB Griff. The Rhino is probably advancing right now. So where's the Rhino at? The Rhino's out of the way. That Trev's about to hit me. Freaking A, dude. If you're gonna sit in Trev's, at least use them. Trev's do reload in 23 seconds. So, that guy's just sitting there with his trebs. For those of you who do run trebs, like, use them. Use them. Even if it's, like, a Gal... Yeah, a Galahad, his shield... I mean, he's got 160,000 hit points in his shield, but at least try. At least, like, do some damage to it. If you're not gonna take it out the first time, you'll take it out within, you know, two, three shots, whatever. But at least start working on it. That might actually be that rhino that backed up. That guy's just sitting there. Oh my god. Camping watch? I'm staying locked on to the Griffin, because he's the one who I can actually, um, I can hit right now. The Galahad is, I'm sorry buddy. Okay, so I was basically behaving as bait to make sure that guy does come out our way. Now I think I should be able to take down that Griffin and finish him off. 
Yep. And that guy's too far. Awesome. Game one. Game one. Oh, holy moly. Okay. <laughs> Let's see what we got going on here. All right, well, you asked me to put this in, so let me at least use it. We're getting that beacon right now. We've got center. We gotta move this way. That guy's gonna be our first target, I'm assuming. He's out over at that side. That's my teammate. Nice. Good job, buddy. We got two Trident Furies out right now. That Zeus is gonna hit me again. That other Trident Fury is gonna fire. That Zeus is gonna hit me again. This is freaking bullshit. This is why nobody runs Fujis. <laughs> um, and also, I think um, it's very situational. It's, it's, it's situational. You know, being able to get him into the right position is going to be difficult. But uh, on the bright side, I did take two uh, Trident hits, and in some cases, in many cases, that's what it's all about. You know, it's it's sometimes taking a bullet for the team, so to speak, literally. In this case, six bullets, each packing a freaking punch. <laughs> Not that way. Alright, this is useless. So fast. Let's try to get some more damage here. Okay, that we can end on. I'm okay with it. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. That was awesome. Um, and yeah. Thank you so much for joining me. Episode 14 of PYOB. I am uh, sorry and uh, apologetic, super apologetic about all the raging. Um, that was terrible. Tonight, we are going to be having a uh, after party. So... Um, Hold on a second, I'm going to talk about that. Um, also, yeah, so special thanks to uh, David Swin and to Mythic for moderating this stream. If you guys enjoyed this episode of PYOB, make sure to hit the thumbs up so more people can see it. If you haven't yet, hit the Chainfire watermark on the bottom of the screen to subscribe to my channel. This way you will be notified uh, when I post videos and when I go live. Uh, as far as live streams, guys, uh, as you know, tomorrow is Tuesday. Tuesday is ladies' night, so um, we will be having a daily upload, hopefully with uh, voiceover commentary. Also, uh, Wednesday and Thursday, we'll be having Chill Slash Kill Squad. Uh, that's going to be super exciting. Um, that's Wednesday and Thursday. Um, Friday, we're going to be having probably a daily upload. And Saturday, we're hopefully going to be having a live stream during that live stream. Or maybe Wednesday or Thursday. It's going to be Wednesday, Thursday, or Saturday, probably, that I'm going to be having my 10,000 gold giveaway. Uh, this 10,000 gold giveaway is to um, celebrate my first 1,000 subscribers. So it'll be 10,000 gold given to 10, uh, divided to 10 different players. Each one will win 1,000 gold. And it will also be uh, just in time for you to be able to take one of those uh, spins if you'd like to gamble. Or if not, make sure to use it for whatever it is you're saving up for. Some really, really good build. Real quick, also, I want to do something because uh, we were running PYOB. Let's talk a little bit about the builds that we ran tonight. So we had the Fujin um, Orkin. Uh, sorry, the Fujin uh, Terran. The Fujin Terran is definitely a, a, a strong and powerful build. We're talking about... <clears throat> The uh, Fujin guys is uh, definitely a very powerful build with the Terrans on it. Each Terran is about 71,000 hit points. 
uh, in a full clip. A clip is about eight and a half seconds to empty. The entire reload, the reload time is about five seconds. So the entire time that it, uh, the cycle of the Terran is 15 seconds, it's able to do 210,000 damage per every 15 seconds. So we're talking about you know 840,000 hit points. Uh, per minute, that's an insane amount of damage, so it's got a very, very high amount of damage. It is situational, though, so you kind of have to be with the beacon advantage. If you have good teammates and your teammates are providing uh, that necessary, um, <clears throat> that necessary, um, uh, you know, help and, and, and working the beacons with you, um, is, uh, you know, you'll be, able to, you'll be able to use that a lot better. Next, we have the Carnage Zeus. The Carnage Zeus is definitely... Uh, one of the best builds, the Carnage Thunder and the Carnage Zeus are the two best builds for um, the Carnage. The Carnage is probably your best investment for your workshop points besides for Terrans. Uh, Terrans, the plasma damage is amazing, so I mean, you know, be, you want to be getting as many Terrans as you can, but uh, if you got extra workshop points laying around, you want to get something else, you want to use it to get a bot, the best robot is definitely the uh, Carnage, is going to be your best bot for your workshop points. Next, the uh, Lancelot Thunder Orkin. This is also a very, very good build. The Lancelot Orkin Thunder. The Thunder you can be using to take shields down. We are seeing a lot more of the British bots, the Camelot robots right now. So um, those, you know, this build is amazing for you to be able to do uh, very high damage. You will be seeing a lot of people running an Ancelot, a Ancel Orkin. The Ancel Orkin is a little step back because you need someone to take out those shields, uh, those Ancel shields before you can hit. Um, so, you know, it basically turns this robot from being a full Camelot pack killer to, you know, something that uh, is, is more just against Galaheads um, and jumping bots. It's really good against different plasma robots if you're able to get within that 300 meter range. The Gareth Plasma is my number one favorite from the Camelot pack. The British bots uh, are amazing. I mean, they got the, the physical shield, which is really good because we are seeing a lot of plasma, like I said, because there is so much. Um, by the way, I'm re chatting here in just a minute. Because there is so much plasma on the battlefield right now, the um, Camelot pack becoming more popular. Uh, I love to see Garrus out there. Garrus are team players, Garrus are beacon cappers, they're distractors, they have extra speed. You are actually able to 1v1 a lot of different robots with it, and it, it does amazing because it's got the speed to outrun uh, Orkins. You know, you're able to um, bait Tridents and uh, RDBs to fire at you. So that's also really, really nice about the Gareth uh, Plasma. Um, next, we had, uh, before we were running the Jesse Pin, the Jesse Pin. Pinata. The Jesse Pinata, I want to tell whoever was that uh, requested that, that's a cool build, it's fun to run, but it doesn't have that much firepower and therefore it's not necessarily your best bet. Um, also, um, as far as in general, I mean the Jesse is is not that great a build, but out of all the builds that you can passively put on the Jesse, Pinatas and Aphids are probably your best combination, a pair of Aphids and a pair of Pinatas, if not two Pinatas. Two, uh, four times Pinatas, that is a decent build for the Jesse, don't get me wrong. Um, but like I said, you know, it's it's also a lot of distraction. It's just going to be a pain in the ass for a lot of the players that are coming up against you. So uh, that's probably where we want to go with it. Um, last but not least, we ran a... No, oh, that was it. That's what we ran tonight. Um, obviously, I did change things up a little bit because, I, you know, I was uh, desperate and uh, needed and in a need for a win. But... Um, yeah, so that's as far as the uh, builds that we ran today. Once again, like I said, thank you so much for joining tonight. I'm now going to be with you in chat. Also, I am going to be opening the Discord uh, channel, so let me go ahead and uh, shoot you a link, and then I'll be able to also read what you're saying on um, on chat here. Let me go ahead and switch out the screens over here just so it'll make it easier for me, um, because i got a lot of stuff going on right now on my computer. So let me switch out the screens. Okay, um, one second, actually, let's, um, yeah, let me close some stuff out here, because this is super, this is, like, a lot going on, on my computer right now. Okay, so that's closed, awesome. All right, and now I can also read uh, chat. 
gonna go ahead and shoot you guys a link to the uh, Chainfire's Links channel. And open that for you guys to be able to join. For those of you who can't join me tonight on Discord, please make sure to say goodbye to me in chat before you go so I can say goodbye to you live. Okay, you can now send messages in the channel. And I'm opening so you can also connect so we can hang out for a little bit here. Alright, you may connect and speak right now in the Chainfire's Links room. Let me go ahead and grab a link for you guys for those of you who want to join us. So we're going to have an after party over here. Alright, here you go. Alright guys, now I'm reading, I'm also reading chat now. Once again, like I said, for those of you who can't join me on Discord, please make sure to say goodbye to me here so I can say goodbye to you live. Uh, you can connect to Discord now and join me. You got blocked and reported by some bloody joke. <laughs> Bye, Mark. Take it, take it easy, Lee. Good to see you, man. Thanks for joining. See you, Elk. Bye, David. Thanks for moderating. Alright, Mythic, I'll see you there. Hey, Popcorn Fury. How's it going, man? Magnum working Griffin. Popcorn, run that on a gala head. The Hellfire gala head is beast. Alright, John, I'll see you there. Love you too, man. No FOMO. What's up, Firebug? Honey Badger in the house. See you, Vicious. Take it easy, brother. Alright, James. If you do, awesome. I'll see you there. And if not, have a good night, brother. Titty and the uh, giveaway will hopefully be uh, Wednesday, Thursday, or Saturday. I'll let you know. Thanks, Predator, man. Good to see you. All right, guys, join Discord. I see we already have uh, several people already joined Discord. We're just waiting for some more people to join there. And also, I'm uh, waiting to see if there was anyone that I uh, missed and uh, didn't say goodbye yet. Hey, Mr. Wildboy. Oh, did you not? I'm sorry about that, buddy. Um, make sure to, if you don't get notifications from my channel, make sure to go to my main page. There's a little bell there. And in the bell, you can change your notification settings. Uh, regardless, though, Mr. Huawei, we are moving to Discord now. So uh, come join us if you can. And if not, have a good night. Wednesday and Thursday, we will be hopefully having chill and kill squads. Um, and also another live stream on Saturday, by the way. So just so you know, uh, one of those live streams is going to have a gold giveaway. All right, James, I'll be right there. All right, Jesus, I'll see you on Discord. Let me go ahead and post the link here again. Alrighty, guys, once again, thanks for joining. Have an awesome night, and I hope to see you real soon in my next video.